If you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV45, anytime on your time. At our law firm, we see you. Come see us at lgkg.com. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. NC TV 45 Newcastle, The Train. Hello and welcome to News Watch. Now, uh, the Hermitage, Lawrence, it's Lawrence Mercer Athena, presents its sixth annual leadership celebration. Now, this is going to be October 23rd from 5.30 to 9.30 at 5 Phillies Farm, State Route 208, New Wilmington. Eight local women will be honored. The 2018 recognition honorees in advance of the women's leadership demonstrate excellence, creativity, and initiative in their community and profession. The honorees for the established Athena leadership include Colleen Chamberlain, HR Director, Youngstown School District, Proprietor of Penny Allenwood Outdoors, Leanne Felina, Partner Rob L Leonard Malfill Law Firm, Michelle Goodman, proprietor of Michelle Studios. The Emerging Athena Young Professionals Award honorees are Michelle Bauer, Program Director of Buell Recreation Club, Anne Marie Mendocino, The Bottle Tree Creative House and Executive Director uh, Yvonne Ovo, and uh, pri pri proprietor leaps and bounds gymnastics. Michelle Torak, I, and I messed up that last name. I'm sorry. Proprietor of gowns of grace and operations director for Guardians Nest, and then Angie Moyer Urban. Executive Director of New Visions for Lawrence County. The Athena Leadership Celebration is open to the public. Registration for tickets and table purchases, donations, and sponsorships must be by October 9th. Okay, so you got to get that in. And you could go to eventbrite.com to get your tickets. Now, uh, Newswatch is going to roll on after we take this break and hear from these great sponsors who keep community television on the air for you. NC TV 45, Newcastle, The Train. Always good to see you on Newswatch. It's the 37th annual Fall Harvest Festival and Craft Fair. 
and this is at Apple Castle. You know all the things they have to do there. You don't have to drive far. There'll be demonstrations by Boy Scout Troop 733, slingshots, food, kids' crafts, fall decor, and you can get your apples. Now, we're going to tell you that it'll be a great fall time. It is Saturday from 9 to 5, so go out and enjoy. Now, uh, Newswatch is going to take a break, and uh, we're going to hear from these fine sponsors who keep community television on the air. For you. Allie's Upper Crust at 1700 Highland Avenue has a full menu. Pizza, roll-ups, salad, soup, sandwiches, strombolis, dinners. They are just great for dine-in or take-out. Don't forget to give them a call at 724-652-7553. It's Allie's Upper Crust. If you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV45, anytime on your time. At our law firm, we see you. Come see us at lgkg.com. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. NC TV 45 Newcastle. The train. Hello and welcome to News Watch. Here's a great fall activity. It's the 28th annual Fall Pumpkin Fest. Yeah, at Connie Lake Park. And that is October 12th at 2 p.m. So head on up and uh, spend a nice weekend with the family. Get away and... Uh, Enjoy Cotty Out Lake Park. Now we're going to take this break and we'll return to News Watch right after these. Months. The 
Cedars is a great restaurant with outstanding Mediterranean food. The Cedars takeout menu is second to none, featuring pizza, stromboli, hoagies, their famous lamb on the rod, and so much more. So when you're hungry and you want that Newcastle taste, make it Cedars. Now it's in Newcastle, 827 Addis Street on the east side, and all Cedars E724-658-9260. Hello and welcome once again to, yeah, you got it, the Cedars Sports Corner. And let's pick up on Major League Baseball first. As um, Friday you'll see the Dodgers taking on, yes, the Milwaukee Brewers, and that's up at Milwaukee. Milwaukee always finds a way to weasel in. And um, Saturday the Dodgers take on Milwaukee again up there, and it'll be Houston taking on the Red Sox. Sunday, Houston takes on the Red Sox again in that matchup. And uh, as Cleveland now has bowed out of the playoffs. Now, as we look at college football, South Florida taking on Tulsa Air Force. They'll be at San Diego State. And Arizona will visit the Utes from Utah. Now uh, keep in mind that uh, we will be carrying later on tonight homecoming and the Newcastle High School football game versus Knock and it's a hockey night in Newcastle as we will have hockey on Sunday night. Hopefully you enjoy and um, Remember NCTV 45 anytime on your time. We're going to take this time out. We'll be right back. Hello and welcome once again to Lawrence County 45 weather. Well, after last night's cloudy low of 43, how is your Friday looking? When you look at radar, rain moving off to the south and east, 
and you get a little clearing in the national radar which shows you your Friday partly sunny a high of 51 now Friday night I believe you're gonna get the games in uh, showers mostly after 1 a.m. call it mostly cloudy a low of 38 and it should be okay for homecoming now Saturday showers likely chance of precipitation 60 percent and don't be fooled when you see a peak of sun here and there now Saturday night partly cloudy a low of 38 Sunday mostly sunny and 58 Sunday night mostly cloudy a low of 43 and then Monday well Karen mostly cloudy a low of 52 showers are likely Monday night with a mostly cloudy 38 chance of rain is 60 percent so Monday's going to be your wet day Tuesday partly sunny and 52 and then Tuesday night partly cloudy and 38 and as you look at Wednesday partly sunny with a high of 53 now uh, not too too awesomely bad not too too great uh, just enough moisture in there to let you know it's fall okay but the temperatures have become more fall like now this was Lawrence County 45 weather and we're going to take this break we'll be right back Standing by my wind. today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Special thanks going out to Town Mall Pizza for sponsorship of this program, located in the Cascade Galleria, Newcastle. There's more than the eye. You gotta give them a Newcastle a try. NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. Well, that's going to do it here for. Remember, tell a friend about NCTV 45. They'll be glad you did. And make sure you get that second cup of coffee. And have a super day in what I call the greatest castle in the world, in the County of Lawrence. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you on down the road. Sleep in the sun with darling